Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Thomas. In this video, we will be covering a question in CBSC 10th grade mathematics. The chapter is real numbers. How to find HCF and LCM of two given numbers and verify whether the product of LCM and HCF is equal to the product of the numbers itself. The first pair of numbers are 26 and 91. So for finding the LCM and HCF, let's use the prime factor. This can be expressed as, if you do the prime factorization, you can get, that means 26 is equal to 2 times 13. And 91 is actually 7 times 13. You can take the product of the smallest power or the least power of common factors. So here the least powers of common factors. First of all you need to see the which, is, which are the common factors. Here only 13 is common. So and the least power is itself. So that means the HCF of these numbers is 13. And for LCM you need to find the highest power you notice the contrast. When you are taking the highest common factor, we are taking the least power of common factors. When you are taking the least common multiple or lowest common multiple, we are taking the highest power of all factors. So here, the, all the factors include 2, 2, 7 and 13. So you will have to multiply all this to get the LCM. So that means 92 uh, that will become uh, 182. So LCM is 182. Then what will be the HCF multiplied by LCM? So that will be 13 multiplied by 182 which is equal to 2366 and you need to check whether the product of numbers is also the same so you can multiply 26 times 91 you are going to get the same number 2366 that means the product of the HCF and LCM will be equal to the product of the numbers. The next pair of numbers we have is 510 and 92. So again, you can factorize it using the prime factorization times 23. Or you can also write it as 2 square times 23. Then we need to find the HCF. HCF is the least power or the lowest power of only common factors. Here only common factors is only 2. Rest everything are not common. So we will take the lowest power of that. That is 2. So HCF is 2. And for LCM we will be taking the highest power of all the, all the factors. The highest power of 2 is 2 square multiplied by all the factors will be taken 5, 70 multiplied by 23 so uh, the, the product of this will be 23,460 you can do the multiplication and see that LCM is 23,460 and you need to verify whether HCF multiplied by LCM is equal to the product of the numbers. So 23,460 so 2 into 23,460 is equal to 46,920. So when you multiply the numbers 510 and 92 you will get the same numbers. You need to verify whether you are getting it or not. Uh, moving on to the next pair of numbers is 336 and 54. You need to 
find the factors of it you can do the factorization of 336 and 54 so 336 you can divide it by 2 and get You can do the prime factorization of this number 8, 4, you get 4, 2, 2, 21, 3, 7, 7, 1. So that means we can write 336 is equal to 2 into 3, 4. 4 that means 2 raised to the power of 4 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 7. So 336 can be written like that and 54. Can be factorized again. This will give you 7, 3, 9. Can divide it again. Again by 3. You will get this. That means you are going to get 2 times 3 raised to the power of 3 or 3 cube. So here we need to find the LCM and HCF. So HCF is always the least power of all common factors here 2 and 3 are present in both the numbers both the uh, uh, 2 and 3 are present in the factorization of both the numbers that means the common factors are 2 and 3 the least power is 2 and 3 so the HCF will be 2 times 3 that is 6 and LCM is the highest power of all the factors so highest power of 2 is 2 raised to 4 and highest power of 3 is 3 raised to 3 and 7 also need to be multiplied with this. Uh, when you multiply it you are supposed to get 3024. So LCM of these two numbers is 3024 and we need to verify whether LCF into LCM is equal to the product of numbers. You can multiply you, need to, you can just multiply HCF into LCM that is 6 multiplied by 3024 and see whether it is equal to 3736 multiplied by 54. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you like it, please share it to your friends. See you in the next video. If you like the video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe the channel.